Well, Heath, after a very long career here at the Carlton Football Club, you've decided to retire. What prompted the decision? Yeah, Loretta, um, yeah, it was a tough one and one that, one that uh, took a lot of th uh, thought um, to come to. But look, uh, in the end, the decision was pretty much made for me. Uh, my body, body's struggling. Um, I've got an ankle injury that I've suffered for a couple of years with, had a few operations on to get right. and. It's just, you know, it's not right. I'm, uh, I'm battling week in, week out to get up, and um, yeah, it's tough physically, emotionally, and and uh, and mentally to, to keep doing that. And um, yeah, I can't probably give the club and the team, the supporters, um, what they deserve, and, and a 100% effort every time you know, get out and train. So yeah, uh, the decision to to, to, to finish now, um, knowing that I can't uh, can't physically go on, was sort of was sort of forced on me, I suppose. So. Yeah. I know you said it's been an emotional day. Uh, what's been the hardest part about telling your teammates or telling the coaching staff? Uh, definitely the teammates. I um, I thought I, I knew it'd be tough, but I thought I could handle it okay. Um, uh, I told the family they were uh, that was okay. I was, um, but yeah, I didn't get a word out when I spoke to the boys. I uh, got a little bit emotional and didn't think it had happened. But uh, it's tough when you when you're talking to your, your peers, your, your mates you played with and uh, worked hard with and. Um, yeah, to tell them that, uh, that, I, that I couldn't go on and I was sort of leaving in mid-year was pretty tough. So, yeah, that was definitely the hardest part. After more than 200 games here, what does this football club come to mean to you? Oh, it means everything. Uh, yeah, I love this footy club and, and the opportunity they gave me when I came over from Collingwood to, to establish myself as a player and, and now to have, to have gone on and played over 200 games and be a life member I'm extremely proud of. And uh, I've loved, loved playing for this club for so long and in, uh, loved being here. and. It's going to be sad to go, but um, yeah, look at uh, the supporters, uh, the fans, the members. Everyone's been fantastic, and um, yeah, it's going to—it's a, it's a sad day, but but it's one that comes for everyone at some stage, and uh, I'm really going to miss it. And but I've loved loved every minute of being here. And what's your message for Carlton members and supporters? Um, look, just just stick with us. You know, there's, there are going to be ups and downs. The boys are a really good bunch of bunch of men and working really hard and. Um, we all want success as, as much as anybody and um, you know, I think it's closer than people think at this club. We've got a, a young, talented list and, um, and, and it'll change again at the end of the year with some new faces but Mick will get the best out of the group and hopefully success is, uh, is a lot, lot closer than people think. So stick with us and um, you know, the support's uh, very important. Well, you're an absolute champion. We know that you'll be sticking around and we'll still be part of this club. So Heath Scotton, thank you. Thanks Loretta. Thanks guys.